Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Hello to my lovely Sagittarius. How are you guys doing this at this time? Hello to my new subscribers. I am Destiny777 Tarot, and this is my YouTube channel. Okay, guys, do be advised that in order to watch my channel, you must be of age, 18 plus and older, okay? I hope this reading is reaching you guys a good energy, good vibes, good health, okay, guys? Thank you all for taking the time out to even view the video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel so that you can see when I post and you won't miss any of my new videos, okay? Make sure your post notifications are turned on, guys. And thank you so much for all of the support and love that you guys show. All right? This is reading is going to be from my Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising Zodiac signs. So do be advised. Cross watchers, you are more than welcome to join us. Okay, returning subscribers, returning viewers, you guys are welcome as well. Thank you so much for all of the love and support that you show. So I'm cleansing the energy at this time, guys, in the room, over my energy, over my cards. Guys, I hope this reading is reaching you all in good energy, good vibes, good health. Okay, guys? I'm doing all right. I hope you guys are doing the same way. Everyone's fine, healthy, taking good care of ourselves at this time. Thank you all for joining and tuning in. Thank you all. Because you know what it is. Because you know what it is, guys. Because I'm back again. I'm back again. Back again. I'm back again. Back again, I'm back again, back again, I'm back again, with a, with a, with a, with another video, another video, another, 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 another video, I said another video, another video, another, 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 another video, I said another video, another video, another, 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 another video. <laughs> Hello guys. Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> All right, we're going to pull up first from the tarot deck, guys. Okay. I'm so happy to see you guys. Let's just shuffle the deck. been trying to cause a lot of distraction guys for you all but nevertheless god will provide and what's yours is yours and nobody cannot take that from you at the end of the day guys if it belongs to you then you shall have it and that's just that on that okay we're gonna jump right into the reading from my lovely, lovely Sagittarius Sun, Moon, and Rising Zodiac signs. Thank you. All right. So, there's a, in, a codependent individual who is in you guys' energy. This person has low self esteem, could be very light, has a low IQ. Um, very codependent for money, uh, finances. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or someone that has a highly aspected in their birth chart. Okay, this is definitely a woman or a, a man. Could be, because, you know, women can be in masculine energy and masculine can be in feminine energy. Okay, we have a little bit of all of us and all of us, guys. So, do be advised about that. And this zodiac signs go further than we all really Assume it to be. You can be a third deacon, second deacon, or fourth deacon Sagittarius. Okay, guys? You could also be um, a fucus. Okay? So, guys, look into all of that. But I feel like someone is giving you or has already offered you a knight of cups. But there is someone that's lingering in you guys' energy. This person doesn't want to be seen, but we can see them. 
I feel like you guys are seeing them also in this person. How, how this person is reacting. Okay, how this person is moving about. Someone is celebrating some tower moment that definitely came down and hit you guys. This is sudden change. Something came and shook things up. Three of Cups is here. It could be a group of people, three or more, that's celebrating this. These people are very low vibrational people, low self-esteem. They don't take very much care of themselves or anybody else around them, okay? Low vibing, low vibing people, okay? Um, Nine of Pentacles, they could be losing a lot of money at this time as well with the Chariot. They want somebody to flee from you, okay? It could be a Cancer that's doing this, guys, or some type of water sign energy. Definitely something being done to a Queen of Wands energy, someone that is an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This person is high vibing, has a lot of self-respect for themselves, a lot of confidence, okay, at this time, guys. This person can be a little fiery, but... For the most part, they demand respect and they give respect, okay? Yeah, somebody wants a masculine, could be a feminine, a powder rose, how they fit, guys. But somebody is looking to end something for someone. They want the, a, a masculine to flee, run away from another energy here. Give me one more card for my Sagittarius. Someone is rising. Yeah, this person is very emotional at this time. But the Ace of Cups could be friends and family. Queen of Cups in reverse. This person is not in sync with their emotions because something is not turning out the way that they thought it would. Okay, guys? Let's continue, though. This person has very, very low self-esteem. They don't have no self-worth. Clarify this amount of Pentacles energy, please, for my Sagittarius. Thank you. Yeah, this Nine of Pentacles feels like you're too much responsibility. When really it's them, that's too much responsibility. They feel like you are a burden when it comes to a Sagittarius male or female. But I feel like this Sagittarius male or female is very guarded towards this other energy. Okay? Definitely third-party energy or third-party interference. They're trying to project onto this Sagittarius masculine, but the divine is intervening here. This is divine intervention. Someone is trying to get this masculine, especially now that things have came into you guys' life with this sudden change, a tower moment has came. They're trying to come on, lay it on thick, come on definitely hard onto a masculine to be this, in this night of wants energy towards you. Flighty, having one night stands, sexual intercourse with another person that they are in. This person is definitely married. It's not a pinnacle's energy, guys. So do be advised. But the divine is here to intervene. Somebody is stressed out because something is not working out the way that they thought it would. Clarify the three of cups, please, from my Sagittarius sun, moon, and rising. Thank you. Yeah, the, this third party is doing something to keep somebody stuck. They want them to be, like, to confuse their mind as well. It could be a high priestess, a tell reader, or somebody of some type of high-vibing nature. It could be a Libra, guys, with a high priestess here. But this person is not taking the necessary steps that need to be took in order to achieve this goal. So whatever it is they're celebrating, it's going to come crashing right down if it hasn't already. This person is definitely no need to go to Karma Waters. There's a Sagittarius male. Who got, it could be a female, guys, but somebody got some clarity. They were confused about something, but they got clarity that they need or they will. Page of Pentacles. Somebody here is getting a new job. This job opportunity could be coming in fast. There's fast communication and fast movement, okay? Somebody got um, interviews coming up, okay? Be careful not to discuss this with everybody because not everybody wants to see you get to this Ace of Pentacles here, guys. Okay, now everybody wants you to be the King of Pentacles. There could also be some King of Pentacles energy. Could be a father figure who's coming in, like they're concerned or they're just trying to get, you know, know what's going on with you. This person could be like of some type of authority. Okay, it could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn, but this person is definitely trying to distract you from your Ace of Pentacles, okay, from moving forward. They could be coming in with a lot of fast communication, fast movement towards you. These people are stuck in some past energy or past situations that happen. So I've had an Ace of Pentacles, please, for my lovely Sagittarius, I'm going to rise in with the King of Pentacles. Yeah, King of Cups. All this is is a distraction at this time, okay? This could be a Pisces, or you could just be in this Pisces energy. You know, you know, being the perfect husband or perfect spouse to your, um, to your divine counterpart here. This is your soulmate. Somebody is up at night, losing sleep, crying, throwing tantrums, okay? Because you made a decision. Yeah, you're in this King of Cups energy. They're trying to distract you from that. You found your confidence here, guys. Could be a Leo also with the um with the uh strength card. Excuse me. Yeah. 
somebody is telling you are coming in bringing bad news crying okay throwing tantrums like a child being very childish could be over exaggerating their situation or this is you guys energy you feel left out in the cold at this time your thoughts are very chaotic at this time or maybe somebody is trying to make you feel this way, okay? Somebody wants you to be unhappy because they're unhappy. This is why they're rushing in because they're miserable. And misery loves company. So if I the tower here for my Sagittarius, sun, moon, and rising, though, that signs. Please give me some care messages. Thank you. Yeah, this tower is brought to you guys just to ruin you guys' as a marriage or relationship, okay? This is the only reason why this tower has came. Somebody definitely conjured up this tower to make someone think differently or feel differently about a situation or towards you or you towards your person or both of you guys, okay? But somebody is still going forward to offer this knight of cups. This masculine or feminine here, whoever it is, apply the rose how they fit, is definitely moving forward. After, it could have been an Aquarius, but somebody that's in this star energy, it's like somebody was attacking you guys mentally. All of your chakras trying to just throw you off balance okay make you not focus and zero in on the situation but you guys are focused okay you guys are very determined you're persevering for knight of cups energy again okay somebody is going or giving you a genuine cup of love it's real okay with the king of wands here this person is determined all right i just want to say guys if somebody is taking the time out to talk about you guys just know that you're doing something right Okay, and this person has no life and they're extremely jealous of you. Knight of, Knight of Cups in reverse, okay? This person, this uh tower was meant to break you guys up, okay? Delay this, this love offer that was coming towards you, okay? With the cherry here, I feel like it's still coming towards you guys. But somebody created a bunch of delays and blockages at this time. Knight of Cups in reverse, yep. I do feel like if you're in this um, King of Wands energy, male or female, determination to move forward, somebody is doing all that they can to get you to change your mind, to get you to be weak, okay, to, to create more blockages for you. The King of Wands came out crossing. So be advised of that, guys. Cut by the King of Wands crossing, my lovely Sagittarius, at this time. Thank you. Yeah, Queen of Wands. They want you guys to walk away from your wife or your divine counterpart, your soulmate. Okay, could be an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. They're trying to do whatever. They're saying whatever. But something's going downhill to or because of a Sagittarius energy. Or a whole situation. Ace of Wands in the reverse. Somebody got a lot of karma to face. Trials and tribulations is definitely coming someone way. Or this is what this tower was. This is what they sent to you guys. Yeah, your, your divine counterpart or your... um your committed relationship your wife somebody wants you to walk away from this person they're trying to turn you against your queen of wands this is the king to the queen this is definitely two married individuals two of wands in reverse they're creating a bunch of delays and blockages at this time for you guys yep they're trying to get you guys to break up divorce cancel celebrations okay nothing but towels they're trying to bring down to you guys they want want you guys to be at the five of cups energy because that's where they are they're, this is projection yep somebody's being sneaky yeah they're trying to get your masculine to lose all type of self-esteem that he may have in himself or you okay for you to doubt yourself queen of swords is here behind that this person is talking a lot of shit to this masculine or this is happening to you guys okay and whatever it is that they're saying is to get this masculine to doubt himself or lose self-esteem lose confidence they're trying to break someone down by talking shit about them or to to them about their person here Okay, the, this seven of cups energy that they want you guys to be in, be careful because somebody is being extremely sneaky, okay? Okay, with the seven of cups, either somebody is trying to get you to get a disease, an STD, or just fill your body up and your soul and your mind and your spirit up with all type of negative energies, okay, guys? With all these seven of cups here, everything that glitter is not gold, okay? So be advised when it comes to these cups, all of these cups, seven is significant, very significant from someone here, seven, seven, okay? And seven, seven, seven is a warning. So do be advised. Okay, I got a seven of cups with the seven of swords upright. So we have, yeah. Someone is letting go. They don't feel stuck, trapped, or bound. They're letting go of feeling that way. They're letting go of the thought of that. Anything about keeping on blindfolds is coming off. 
all of that is coming to an end. There, someone definitely did not succeed at trying to hold someone down, keep them stuck, trapped, or bound. You could be a Libra or have it highly aspected in your birth chart. High priestess energy is here. Justice is will be served with the justice card. Yeah. We got the two of pentacles that came out here. So I thought a queen of wands with the ace of cups. Yeah. This queen of cups was trying to make someone go on hermit mode. Okay? Thinking that they tried to either isolate this person or make this person, like, withdraw away from you. And I don't feel like that worked because this person is, is, is in the reverse. This Queen of Cups energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy is in the reverse. Four stars are harming with the chariot in the reverse. Thank you. Yeah, it could be in a group of people that was trying to isolate an individual or make this individual flee from you. Okay, they were very optimistic about this decision, about this journey, about these plans that they had, Aries energy. Okay. But some, it could be a Leo. They, they felt very strong. They felt very entitled to do this. Yeah, but there, there's a, a masculine or a feminine here that's not accepting someone offers. Could be actually ignoring somebody. Choosing to focus on their relationship. Spell work in the reverse. Magician in the reverse. Whatever they try to do definitely is backfiring or it's not working. Can't find the fool. Something is not working, yeah. But there is an energy that is feeling like something was a good idea and now it's a burden it could be a sagittarius there's a sagittarius because we have the ten of wands here that's sagittarius energy and the knight of swords is sagittarius energy i feel like someone's rushing in extremely fast or this is just somebody in this energy okay but there's an individual could be male or female that's rushing in extremely fast okay that feels like i don't feel like that's your person's energy though but like I said at the beginning of the reading, guys, there is an individual here that's living in someone's energy. They refuse to release someone, okay? So they're showing up like they're in, like they're in your person's energy. They're rushing in as fast as they can, trying to force communication with another individual, okay? They're trying to ruin someone's relationship. They're trying to tell this person that the best thing for them to do is to continue to look outside of themselves for happiness, meaning they should have one night stands, continue to cheat, to continue to be in that type of player energy, play girl, play boy, whatever you are, okay, whatever uh, sex you are, guys. But there's basically people here, it could be family or friends, a group of people, three or more, that's feeding someone very negative, bad advice. Okay, they feel like they don't need the approval of others. They don't care that it's bad. They, this is just what they want to see happen. They want to see two people break up and divorce. Or they want to get two people to divorce. This is your soulmate here. The lovers is here. Okay, Gemini energy. This person can have Gemini highly aspected in their birth chart. Or you do. But the, the um, Ten of Cups here, this is your family. You Somebody wants kids with somebody and somebody does not want that. They're trying to put a stop to that Scorpio energy. Death card is here with uh, the Empress. There's someone's mother that is having a whole heart attack because she is trying to prevent a pregnancy from happening. Or a baby mama. This person could be lying, saying they're pregnant as well. So somebody is not pregnant. Yeah. Or lying, saying... They're trying to come up with different ideas, but they can't. They have no ideas right now. They're having a mental clarity block. A mental block right now because they don't know how to stop someone from having kids or having this little family or being in this family dynamic. Six of Wands energy upright. You could be someone that's on television or has a lot of fame. YouTube famous, Instagram famous, TikTok, whatever it is for you guys. Yeah, they're doing they're also doing spell work against whatever you do for work. Future, they're trying to do spell work on your future plans and everything else. Somebody is constantly sitting there also reminding someone constantly what you did or what you said to them. So they can, they, this person can release you with, this, with the five of cups here in reverse. Okay, so this person will block you, walk away from you, ignore you for good. They're doing spell work heavily to get this person to do this. Whatever it is that they're saying to them is also very manipulative and gaslighting-ish. Clarify the page of wands upright with the magician here, please. Yeah, it could be a Pisces or someone in this energy, Cancer, that's coming in with some bad news just to delay someone from walking away with the five eight of cups in reverse. Yep. This is all just trying to get get someone to reconcile with them and to delay a situation from happening or a decision being made. Yep. Five of after some heavy, I feel like somebody also. Is resting or is going to rest or has been resting and doing a lot of thinking and meditating. 
it could be about some decision or a final judgment on something. Okay, but there's an energy here that's going to be devastated about some news that they're going to receive after someone slept on it or meditated or, or contemplated about the situation. We have the four of swords here. Somebody had to sleep on something or really think about it. And it's another energy. It could be this third party interference. These people or this person that's going to be left focusing on lost, extremely sad, devastated, depressed. Okay, heartbroken. They're going to feel shameful as well. They're going to be frustrated, if not also sexually frustrated, but frustrated with the divine. Because something is not going to go their way. Clarify the judgment here. My Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Zodiac signs at this time. Ancestors, guides, God. Please give me a few messages. Yeah, the Emperor in reverse. Somebody, the divine called judgment on a situation because there's other energies here that is trying to knock someone off their throne, okay? Aries energy. You could be an Aries or have a highly aspected in your birth chart. I'm also talking to a Sagittarius. You could be a Sagittarius or Aries highly aspected in your birth chart. Somebody is working against you at this time. They're trying their best. We have the Eight of Cups here, upright. They're working hard, okay? Trying their best to affect your life in every way, shape, or form. This is spell work, manipulation, gas. Like somebody is trying to win at all costs, okay? They don't want you. They want you to be a deadbeat. They don't want you to be the, a, a good father either. The emperor in reverse is a, the emperor is a father figure. This person is in control of everything. Okay, their finances, work life, home life. This person is a provider. They want you to be the total opposite. Okay, with the emperor in reverse, temperance energy is here. This could be happening to a Sagittarius. Okay, by the emperor here in reverse. Yeah, six of swords energy. You're sailing off the calmer waters. It could be with another Sagittarius as well, too, guys. Yeah, you're balancing things out between you and your person at this time. Your your soulmate, the ten of pentacles here. You and this person can be are, and is very abundant with each other. Okay? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Somebody can have that in their birth chart somewhere as well, too. You're, you're working on trying to balance things out with your divine person. That's why you're going to karma waters. This is someone who you love, you want to be with. You cherish this person. And whoever's in this energy of... Not wanting to look at things differently and try to create a bunch of delays for somebody. You got a bunch of karma to face with the Ace of Wands here in the Page of Swords. Yeah, you got a bunch of karma to face. Whoever's being staying stuck in the past, also talking trash shit, or staying stuck in the past about some Six of Wands energy that's moving forward. This person that's being very much celebrated at this time. Yeah, you got karma to face. Somebody knows that. Clap out the Nine of Swords upright, the Eight of Swords upright. Guys, ancestors, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine of swords, please. Thank you. Yep. Whoever's in the energy of trying to keep someone stuck, trapped, and bound, things are going down here for you. Trying to keep someone blo bl blindfolded, blindfolded from the truth with heavy manipulation, spell work. <clears throat> yeah. Whoever's in this energy of saying they're going to win at all costs, but you're sitting there trying to figure out how the fuck am I still losing? How somebody knows something? How was somebody still doing something? How did they find the strength to grow? To ascend to grow? Yeah, you try, You could be even trying to set somebody up, trying to figure out how can you do this? Good luck. Five of Wands energy. You can't compete when you don't compare. That's why you're sitting there also looking stuck. Looking stupid. Nine of, um, yeah, what's this? yeah, somebody's working extremely hard, guys. So do be advised with the Eight of Pentacles energy and the Seven of Pentacles energy here. Also with the Five of Wands. Somebody is working extremely hard against you guys, okay? Day and night. You guys need to stay prayed up. Take your spiritual baths. Invest in that pink salt and that black salt, guys. I don't care. Do it ritualistically. Somebody is upset over some finances. Six of... Uh, Six of Pentacles energy. It could be a Taurus, Drake, or a Capricorn. Somebody's mad because this masculine or this feminine, whoever is in this energy where they can give or they feel like they they um there's somebody that that can give this third party or third party interference feel like this masculine or feminine is someone that can give. They want them to give to them. Okay, somebody wants is is definitely wanting to be treated like a side piece and be 
uh, breadcrumbs or juggled. Somebody is down for it. With the Queen of Pentacles here in reverse, this person losing a lot of money and their self-respect could be losing their mind. Okay, this third party is someone that's being released with the Three of Swords here upright. And they're trying to cry and say that they're heartbroken about this. Somebody is money hungry. All they care about, yeah. Whoever is in the Six of Pentacles energy and trying to keep someone stuck and affect somebody's life. Okay, it's going down here. It's not going to work. Will of Fortune in the reverse. You're not going to do anything to keep this person stuck. Anybody here in this situation. Not their feminine or their masculine. No. The moon here, this individual is very deceptive. This third party energy. They could be crying out to the moon as well. Trying to create all type of delays and blockages. Somebody is very manipulative. Four of pentacles energy. This person is losing a lot. They're trying to hold on to everything that they have. This third party. Because they know karma about to come slap their ass. Yeah, we got the hair found here in reverse. They in this energy. If I don't, I don't have to get any type of... Answers or say so's from no authority, nobody, no one. I make my own answers. I make my own decisions. I do what I want. I am the champion. I win. I whoever's in that energy there, this third party. Yeah, you're gonna get exactly what you're looking for. Eight of Cups. They want to forgive and forget. They want to come out of conflict. They're playing on your emotions with the Five of Swords here, because you're someone that know you need to walk away, but you're still sitting there in that situation. This person is playing on your emotions at this time. Just be aware of that. Overall message is there's someone out here who got karma to face. Trials and tribulations in the near future. Ace of Wands in reverse. Outcome, please. What's the outcome of the situation? My lovely Sagittarius. Sun, Moon, and Rising. Thank you all for watching the video this far. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Turn on your post notifications so you can be notified whenever I post. Okay, guys? Make sure that bell is on. Thank you all for taking the time out to view the video. Thank you for your comments, your likes, your subscriptions. Okay? Please remember to subscribe to the channel, guys. If the reading resonates, take what resonates. Please leave what does not resonate. No negative comments is welcomed here. All positive energy. We are a family here. If you have nothing nice to say, don't have nothing to say at all. Yeah, the star energy here. Somebody is going to be a star. They're going to ascend. Aquarius energy here. Okay, six of wands is right behind that. Okay, you can't hold this star down or somebody down. It's trying to hold a star down. Not going to work. Page of swords in reverse. Okay, yeah. The only person that you're holding back is yourself at this time. You're not even holding back this Nine of Wands energy that you're trying to hold back. And this person is the slowest moving knight in the deck. Could, could, could be a Taurus. Somebody is African American or just has black hair, black eyes. Could be Chinese, any race, guys. Six foot four, eleven four foot. But there's definitely a Pisces or whoever's in this energy of keeping somebody stuck and trapped is not going to work. Page of Swords in Reverse. This person could be trying to draw someone into arguments or there's a masculine here that's trying to draw someone into petty arguments, got a uh, go petty gossip. This person has a cold heart. Okay, whoever this indiv individual is, could be this masculine or this third party or someone that's cloaking their energy. Whatever you're trying to do to this star energy is not going to work. This person is going to shine, they're going to be celebrated, they're going to be happy, they're going to live a good life. Let's get the hidden truth messages here, please. But the outcome, the overall message here is the Ace of Wands in reverse. Somebody has trials and tribulations they're facing in their future. You are the best thing in my life. Messages, please. I know exactly what I was doing. Ancestors, guys, God, and my lovely Sagittarius is at this time. It was my fault, but I blamed you. I know I messed up everything. If there's a third party interference, this is definitely their energy, guys. They know exactly what they're doing and they're happy about it. Somebody is celebrating this in a sick, twisted, demonic ass way. We both know I am not the one for you. I feel you even though we are apart. I am not available. Just the messages, guys. I left when I saw you with someone else. You and I were too young. I know I was a distraction from your pain. At the bottom of the deck, guys, we have, I love you unconditionally. So, guys, take heed to those notes, those little messages there. Let's post some messages. 
from the time frame oracle deck. Just messages from my Sagittarius. So I'm going to invite in my sisters, guys. Please get your messages. Thank you. It will happen right before the summer months. So for some of you, this situation already happened. That, that's your answer there. That's your confirmation. Before the end of the year, we have here for a few of you. Thank you. The momentum is rolling. Stay positive. It's on its way. So guys, keep your head up in this situation. Whatever it is that you're facing at this time. Time frame is within a few days. Is at the bottom of the deck. So those were your messages, my lovely Sagittarius is. Thank you all for taking the time out and even view the video. Please remember to stay prayed up, guys. Invest in your protection, okay? Make sure you're taking your spiritual baths. Make sure you're drinking a lot of water. You're taking care of yourself, guys. Going outside regularly. Getting some fresh air. And you know what they say. Be too tired for those energy vampires, guys. Okay, stay strong. Stay positive. You're definitely going to get through this. You guys are amazing, okay? You guys are so supportive. My lovely Sagittarius is. I thank you all so much for the love and the support, okay? Continue to share my video. Share with your friends. Continue to comment constructive criticism down below, guys. Thank you for answering all questions that I need to be answered and showing so much love, guys, all right? Make sure you're investing in yourself as far as your protection. Whatever you are doing, do it ritualistically so that you can get the results that you need because there's somebody here that is working against all of us guys you know and we have to work back we have to do it diligently we have to be determined optim optimistic you have to want this guys okay you guys have it in you you're strong you're positive you're great you're growing you're ascending okay you are at the end of the day thank you all we are now at 438 subscribers so yay we are growing Thank you all, okay? Until next time, that was your messages, guys. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. I shave.